It's one of the enduring images of World War II. As U.S. Marines stormed the island of Iwo Jima off Japan in 1945, six of them raised the American flag on the highest point, Mount Suribachi. That moment, captured by an AP photographer, became a morale boost back home and the inspiration for the U.S. Marine Corps Memorial at Arlington National Cemetery. One of the surviving Marines, Private First Class Rennie Gagnon, posed for the sculpture and took part in bond drives after the war. But tonight, the Marines say it turns out he was not one of the six in that iconic photo. The man thought to be him was actually Corporal Harold P. Keller, the Marine on the backside of the flagpole. The mistake was discovered by amateur historians who've spent years figuring out who actually raised that flag. I think it's important for the legacy of not only them, but their families, and always remembering that, again, this is someone's grandfather. Um, this is going to be someone's great-grandfather, and it's important that we get history correct. Private Gagnon was at Iwo Jima. He brought up the big flag raised in the photo and retrieved a smaller one used in an earlier flag raising there. So this is Harold Keller, as you can see, kind of like a square jaw right there. Among the telltale evidence that it was Keller, distinctive creases on his helmet, his shirt collar lying outside his jacket, and the way he carried ammunition. Corporal Keller's daughter says it's a big surprise. It gives you a, an amazing, <laughs> get emotional here, it gives you an amazing feeling that I just can't even describe to look up and just think, whoa, that's my dad. Three years ago, the historians discovered that the man second from the left in the photo and memorial was also misidentified. Tonight, the Marine Corps says every Marine who set foot on Iwo Jima will always be part of its cherished history. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.